tonight I've got yet another craft holster review, except this time it's a shoulder holster. And this is the most comfortable shoulder holster I've owned so far. I bought a couple other on Amazon, cheap ones. I think they're around like $30 or something like that. And they were extremely uncomfortable. The Velcro was digging into the back of my neck and my shoulders and under my armpits. And this thing is so comfortable. I did a mile hike uh, yesterday with it and I could barely even tell it was there. I've got a 357 meg Ruger GP100 on me and two speed loaders and I can barely even tell it's there. But yeah, I'm like a half a mile in on my mile hike to the shooting spot and so far an A plus for comfort. That's for sure. So let's get into this thing. It's got this swivel feature on there because it's a vertical draw. And you got the finger snap, of course. And then it also comes with this tie down loop. You can tie it down to your belt loop or to a belt itself. And then you can get this for a revolver, which I did, which gives you two speed loader pouches right there. Or if you get it for a semi-auto handgun, like a Glock 17, you would get two leather magazine pouches. So if you're new to my channel, or you haven't seen my previous reviews on craft holsters, holsters, the first one I got was this guy right here for my Glock 17, and it's a Kydex leather combination, which I had custom made, because I'm left-handed and as you can see it has great retention and it even works with a Glock plate mounted optic just barely clears and then after that I was so impressed I decided to get this for my Ruger GP100 and 357 mag the same thing kydex and leather combination and it also has great retention, and they're both extremely comfortable. I've just had pure Kydex holsters, basically, since I've been shooting. So having this rubbing up against your hip instead of rough Kydex like that, it's it makes a huge difference. And then not only that, this leather forms to the shape of your hip when you tighten your belt down. So here it is up close. It's got great retention on that, and then here's the swivel, look how smooth that is, so it comes out nice and easy, and then as you can see, I got a custom monogram of my initials, KC, on there, and I believe it's a $10 charge to do that, which is extremely cheap for how good of a job they do. And so here is also the tie down buttons to go around your belt like that. Ooh, that went over the camera. <laughs> So, I've got this loop fastened in my belt now, so let's take a look and see the change that makes. Oh yeah, that makes a huge difference.
This is real Italian leather. It's mahogany. And here are the speed loader pouches. This comes with these two pouches for speed loaders. So, boom. You got 12 more ready to go right there. Got a button on each side and they fit your standard 357 Magnum speed loader. So there's one and then here's the other. So you can have 12 rounds ready to go on your side with six in there and you're ready to go. And this thing is so comfortable and it does an excellent job at concealment. When I have a sweatshirt on, nobody, it's almost impossible to tell that I'm carrying, especially with this large a uh, revolver. I mean, this thing isn't small. It's a 357 mag with a 4.2 inch barrel. So it's not like it's a small handgun by any means. Okay, so here it is in all of its glory. And just wanted to get an up close shot of this leather. This stuff is really nice. Handmade by Craft Holsters. It's Italian leather. There is the custom monogrammed initials that I got on there. So now I'll show you some of the other things that came with this after we just go over this one more time. Close up. So you can see you got that swiveling motion. And then we'll take a look at the back side of it. And there's the shoulder straps, and then now there's a look at the speed loader compartment. And so one of the benefits to this style, a vertical ro roto holster, is when you're holding it on your shoulders, it's pointed down at the ground. So it's technically not flagging the person behind you like some of the sideways shoulder holsters are. But it also came this bag, which has a tag on it showing exactly what you got. It's a nice bag. It has drawstrings on it. And it's a good way to protect your leather shoulder holster when you're not using it. And another thing it comes with is a chamber flag, which is a really nice added bonus. So if you're at the range and you need to show that there's nothing in the chamber, you would just open your cylinder and insert the chamber flag in place to show them that your firearm is secure when there's a ceasefire. And then one more thing that I got that's optional is a really nice thing about these holsters is when you get them, they are so stiff and so tight that you can barely push it into place. So what you do, and they have instructional how to videos on their own YouTube channel, which I will link in the description. They have this for sale on their website for $10. It's a break-in, it comes with a breaking guide, but then you can buy this for $9.99. It's a break-in kit, and I got it. And what you do with it is you basically apply some of this formula to the inside there you spray it in and then I sprayed a little bit on this swab and got all the nooks and crannies after applying that solution to it you take your handgun and you wrap it in a plastic bag like so and then you jam it in there 
and then you let it sit overnight and in the morning it will fit like a glove so I thought that was pretty cool it's just $9.99 and it's definitely worth it so I would check it out if you guys are planning on trying out one of these craft holsters and the braking kit also comes with a polishing rag for polishing your holster and so I have leather Timberland work boots so what I've been doing periodically is applying some leather shoe wax to it which helps soften leather and it increases the life of it and gives it a nice shine so that's another thing you can do Got it. All right, well, I'm gonna call it a day. We are on the top of the mountain and we got ourselves a good mile and a half walk back. Thanks for watching my channel. And if you're in the market for a holster or a shoulder holster, definitely check out craftholsters.com because they got any style you need and you can customize anything you want. They'll make it for you and it's very high quality leather and kydex and i've got nothing but good things to say about them and they have amazing customer service so go check them out i'll link them in the description thanks for watching don't forget to give me a like and subscribe and have yourselves a good rest of your day